kind of been in the club for a minute, you know. We maybe was in the parking lot of the club. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We ain't never left the club though. We still on their premises. You know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. So I'm waiting for it to come back into, you know what I'm saying? To that man. Well, well, I'm waiting for it to come back to man. That that not even not even so much that classroom. Just just I'm just waiting for it to come back to where like. You know what I'm saying? You can hear something and you, and you can you can see somebody's story. Completeness, man. Authenticity, man. You know what I'm saying? Authentic artists, man. Mm-hmm. That's what I want to see, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I don't, don't want to hear no more fairy tales and, and this and this and that. And, you want to hear somebody's story. Yeah, I want to hear a story. You know, tell me what you're about. Even if you party and drink champagne all day. You know what I'm saying? Tell me how did you lead up to that. Right. You know what I'm <laughs> yeah, saying? Because uh-huh. no one go from zero to 60, man. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We starving artists out here, man. We might be doing good. I'm okay, but compared to where I know, you know what I'm saying, where I want to be, and I'm sure she is what we capable of being, and, 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 and all my Chicago artists, man, you know what I'm saying, we all starving artists, man, until we know what we feel we should be, potential-wise. Mm-hmm. You said it was coming back around, Q. Hey, man. For, for each of y'all, man, the buzz that you have built up, you know, just talk about that. Um, you know, you mentioned the, the Facebook what does it mean, you know, we, we just asked the one side, how was it when you feel underappreciated? When you do get that love, when you do get that respect, um, how does that feel? And, and just talk about, you know, building that buzz up. That's crazy. That's like at an all-time high, man, um, to be able to make people believe us, to have people believe in you and believe in the music. Um, like I said, I just I started out doing everything on my own. And I just found a way to make a buzz for myself. Mm-hmm. And, um, you know, just grinded and grinded, you know, taking my, my records to GCI every single week till they knew who I was, knew my face, knew my name. Um, you know, and being an unsigned hype, that really, like, catapulted me and it really made people, you know, want to check for what was going on with me, you know what I mean? Because for me to be, you know, featured in a national magazine, like, that just had people... Like, man, okay, like, who is this dude? Okay, like, let's check him out. Let's see what's going on with him. You know, people listen to the music. And I think, you know, on Let Me Your Air, my first album, you got my story. And, you know, you, you got to see really who I am as an artist, who I am as a person. You know, it was a real personal album. And, um, you know, I think it just connected with people. People could touch it. You know, they could feel it. They understood my story. Probably been there to themselves. I told the story of, you know, not just myself, but, you know, everybody from my hood, Maywood, 21 Blocks of Terror, and, you know, they could relate to it. So, you know, just getting to this point where I'm at now, you know, was fulfilling, it was good, but now I'm ready to see, you know, what the next step is going to take me to and, you know, see, you know, how much more the buzz grows and, you know, the fan base and, you know, at the man on fire, see where it takes me. Mm-hmm. Uh... The biggest thing, man, like, that motivated me, man, like, because, you know, it, it, we all got family, we got friends, you know what I'm saying, and, they, and they, they motivate us. And even if, you know, you like your music or they don't, like, you would never really know the truth. Right. Exactly. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, like, uh, like she was kind of saying, man, I mean, I didn't, I didn't, I'd have been blessed, you know, to receive, uh, you know what I'm saying, a, a few radio spins, man, and, you know, where people know my name and, um, you know, in a sense, kind of, you know, I'd have had a, maybe a couple of shows where people be kind of anticipating to see me, you know what I'm saying? And it kind of throw me for a loop. And along with that, and, and, and you know, when people from overseas, and I think that's kind of like up to this point, it's like my biggest accomplishment, man. And it, it kind of bothers me because, uh, you know, you never actually know who those people are until they speak up. But I'm sure like Shields know, you know, by selling, you know, my joint is like on iTunes, Amazon, Rasfordy, all of that, Napster. Mm-hmm. So, you know, at the end of uh, uh, that month or whatnot, you know, when I get them statements in I'm, and I'm seeing, you know, the little records I sell, even if it's like 20, 25 of them, you know, whatever it may be, you know what I'm saying? And they break it down if they bought the album or they just bought a song, might sell 30 songs, might sell four songs. Mm-hmm. But the places that it come from, right. I swear, it's, it's kind of like the best feeling in the world and it makes me drive because it's like some, you know, it lets me know like it might come from the United Kingdom or it might come from Switzerland. Right. I'm sure you know shit mm-hmm. like it might come from Switzerland or Germany or, or, um, you know, Poland. You know what I mean? In places I've never been, I don't know these people, you know what I'm <laughs> saying? But, and I, I be trying to figure like where they come, you know, is it, they just iTunes heads where they just go through and find rap music right, or, right, right. you know, but then sometimes, you know, 
like she'll say, I might get a message out the blue, you know what I'm saying? Where, you know, keep going. Like, I didn't get a message one time from Japan. I never forget. This one, my space was cracking for all my my space head. You know, I got a, I, and I had to translate it. You know what I'm saying? I, I got I Google the translation. I had to copy and paste it. Oh, man. And just put it in the translation. You know what I'm saying? It was yeah. just basically like, you know, uh, you know, we, we love you. You know what I'm saying? Uh, keep, uh -huh. You know, we like your music. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I don't know if they understood it or not. Oh, <laughs> but you know, that just that just that just added another, you know, that gave me lifespan, man. I added another year uh -huh. yeah. to my process, yeah. man. So y'all keep praying for me, man. Pray for Shields, man. Pray for pray for us, man. Hey, let me let me let me before. say something about the radio spins too, man, because I be seeing a lot of artists, you know. I don't know about you, but I, I know me, you know, like the little Go Ill radio spins, you know what I mean? I, I done got to spend a few times oh, like yeah. in a couple different mix shows, you know what I'm saying? But those Go Ill radio spins, I don't care if you get played one time, man, there's people who make music and go their entire lifetime and never have a record played on the radio. Yeah. So I don't care if they spend it one time, right. 30 times, I can say, man, I heard myself on the radio before, you know what I mean? So. I don't take for granted those spins. Like, like that's a blessing. Mm -hmm. You know, if, if I don't make another record today, like if I stop rapping right now after we leave up out of here, man, I got a lot of things that I can look back on and say, man, I did that. I accomplished that. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? So, you know, I see artists take those for granted, but you know, I'm I'm one of them dudes, man. I'm thankful for everything. You know what I mean? Cause that's a blessing. Like I said, people go an entire lifetime and never hear themselves over radio. And I done heard myself on the radio for consecutive weeks, you know, go ill radio, mix shows, you know, and it's a blessing, man. Yeah. Truly a blessing. I think I, th I think it's just something about hearing yourself coming from, because <laughs> I feel the same way. Like when I heard the, the first time, you know, shots out of Timbo too, they played my joint, I ain't know about it. Mm -hmm. You just get the calls. Right, like, yeah, man, right, you, right. you know, no, man, you know. That's what be the best, though. Yeah, that, right, that's the that, best, that, better that's than you best. actually yeah, hear it. That's the best. Oh, man, they played you on the radio. You lying, man. Right, yeah. <laughs> man, nah, they just played you, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, okay. And then, you know, I heard one time, they, you know, 92.3 played me, and I, and I knew, because I went up to the station, politic with them, and uh, when it, it came through, man, it, it was just like a, it was a weird feeling, because it was like, like, just me coming through this radio. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So it, it's... Like she would say, man, I'm, I, I don't take I don't take nothing for I don't take nothing in life for granted, man. Period. You know what I'm saying? I, I ain't big on the resolutions, man. But my whole thing this year, man, take this day, uh, take this year a day at a time, man. And I've been like that with the music. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, you know, Q, you said it was coming back around, <laughs> man. <laughs> I'm, you see, I'm doing my part. <laughs> Please keep keep doing your part, man. You know, a lot of guys ain't doing their part, man. I'm, um, a lot of people argue. I mean, a lot of people complaining. And they ain't doing their part, man. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And all we gotta do is just support the real, man. Yeah. Support good music, man. That's it, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Artists, non-artists, fans, non-fans, man. Just support your artists, man. Yeah. Even if you like my haircut, you know, support it. If you like Shields T-shirt, support it. You know what I'm saying? We we want to yours, Chicago. Don't you know what I'm saying? Don't wait to. You know what I'm saying? We get to the House of Blues and United Center. Right, right. <laughs> you know, we on the Paul Radio right now with no budget. Uh -huh. All out of pocket, you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. It's out of pocket action, man. These projects coming up, man, it's, 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 it's you know, I ain't gonna get into that, man. Hey, Q, we, you said it was coming back around, we, man. We, so. we, we, we'll get, we, we getting back into the music. Um, 